Men do not just survive because their leg is working, because their hand is working. No, there is a system and energy that regulate them. And oftentimes it's not because there is blood in their veins. No, there is a spirit that gives life. Anytime you bring men to that understanding, everything in them begins to receive life. Because for adventure, if your eyes is not working, because your eyes is dead. For adventure, if your ear is not working, because your ear is dead. What it needs is the administration of life. It's a resurrection, my friend. One of the things that God has to do for us is to make us become that life-giving spirit. Because when a man becomes a life-giving spirit, he becomes an administrator of wonders. Matthew 24 from 24. The Bible said, For there shall arise first Christ and first prophet, and shall show great signs and wonders, in so much that if it were possible, they shall deceive the very elect. One of the things that falsehood mimics so much is signs and wonders. Has never been so much things that has been mimicked in the body of Christ like signs and wonders. You can't fake many things, but you can fake signs and wonders. Mentor of mine say, Why fake what can be real? What it meant is simple. It's because of the glamour nature of the glory that comes with signs and wonders. Men think it's all about themselves. I told you, no sign point to itself. Every sign points to something more than itself. When you say a sign but somewhere, know that it's pointing you to a location. The location may not be seen, eh? but the sign board does not really matter. Every time God does a sign and he does a wonder in the life of men, it's so that he can point them to something. And but eventually, you come to a point where the sign points to you, it means you are forced. The Bible says many false people will rise. So many false will, will rise. And the goal of them is to present to us a savior, a Christ, a Messiah that is not the one that came from heaven. The goal is to point to us to let us understand that they are the one that does it. From the death of Catherine Kuma to the days of Idahosa. All our fathers of faith, from their very days, those days. At Bishop Pesci, that also will say, I am not the one that does the miracle. I don't have the gift of raising the dead. I don't have the gift of anything. It is the Lord that doeth it. I remember Mama Kachin Kuma will say the same thing before she do anything. She say, please don't put your eyes upon me. I have never healed the sick before. I have never healed headache before. There is a God that do it. Do not lose the sight of him. Because anytime you present men to God, God help them. When you try to present yourself to them, the time we come, all they will see is your carnality and your weakness. And this is the reason why oftentimes we don't receive so much miracles in giving to our personal life because we don't focus on God. And what I'm trying to let you understand is that anytime you focus so much on the sign and on the wonder, without you becoming the sign and the wonder, what happens is this. A time comes when a new Messiah is introduced unto you. Now sometimes that Messiah may not be in allegiance to the God of heaven. Four suits shall come. You must be careful. The Bible speaks about the woman with the issue of blood. Did you hear what the Bible said? That she went to and fro. She went to all kinds of doctors. Went to all kinds of false men. The Bible says she finished everything. The time came she was so broke. When she is broke, when nobody can receive her again, the God that can receive all men accepted her. Many more times, God became the last option that people go to when it was supposed to be the first option. The Bible said, if, if it was even possible, the very elect of God would be deceived. How many of us have gone to falsehood just to look for signs and wonders? How many of us? Is there not a God in Israel? There is a God in Israel, but the God in Israel does not know you. It went so worse that one of my friends called me and said, he is a prophet in their family. But their father and their mother give some money to some false people. They, they come to bury things in their house. And I said, the reason is simply because your life cannot produce tangible results. The problem is that you may be a wonka of signs, eh? but you have not become the sign and the wonder. By the time you come to a point where your life becomes the sign and the wonder, you become an administrator of life. The Bible says the first Adam was a living soul. The second Adam became a life-giving spirit. When you become a life-giving spirit, you can administer signs and wonders. They came to a man at the gate. Say, silver and gold we do not have. But such as we have in the name of Jesus, rise up and walk. By the time a man becomes a life giving spirit, he can become an administrator of signs and wonders. That is what the Lord intends to do. He can bring you to that point where you become a life giving spirit so that you cannot be tossed to and fro by every wind of doctrine. 
when your life becomes a sign and a wonder every aspect of your life begin to move people begin to wonder what what's going on here how did this thing happen well it happened by the finger of god no wonder when jesus christ casted out they tried to record it to better but they say well we know a man that has done this before and he did this through his spirit have you met some muslim people that can cast out demons you have not seen muslim cast out ajalu you have not seen and your quest for the supernatural is too weak i have taken my leg to babalao shiran before i saw what they did i see how they can conjure spirit there are realms of power that is not from the holy ghost and those realms can produce a certain level of resolve <laughs> but the problem is that they present you another christ they present you another lord and they present you another kind of spirit and by the time you return back home an influence beyond you come upon you and this is the reason simply because you have not joined it to become a life giving spirit i want to let you understand that beyond just receiving the miracle you can become a worker of miracle you can become a sign and the one the bible said this sign shall follow them that believe in my name they shall do this and this and that a lady called me from portacord he said her brother is so demonized he just came back home and he began to manifest she was just coming out from the secret place and suddenly as he passed by her he began to manifest well she called me say what should she do i said cast out the demon say me say no i cannot do it i said are you okay Say she realized that demon can see that you are not righteous. I said, Are you not righteous? Say, eh, Papa, I did not see you. No, I didn't see. I said, then What are you afraid of? Say, I thought you must reach a level before you can be able to do this thing. Say, What if I'm removing a demon? The demon then tell me, I say, Young woman, you are talking too much. The Bible says, These signs shall follow them that believe in my name. I said, Do you know the name of Jesus? I say, yes. I say, Why? Well, start your job now. I say, Hold this. I say, Hold what? I say, Hold this hand. She hold it. I say, Send the name of Jesus out. As she began to say, she just saw how the devil can become so weak. And a man that was manifesting, suddenly, as she was saying, out, he began to shout. And that was how the spirit left him and he fell flat on the ground. From that very moment, her confidence went high. You can become a sign and a wonder to your nation. You see, that calamity that is going on in your family, one day you can rise as a warrior and say, today, thus far shall thou go and no more further. By the time you begin to wake up at night and begin to challenge, the thrones of darkness in your family you will discover that they are not strong as they claim they are that idol in your father's house is there and is strong because you are weak the day you rise up to begin to fight you now realize that their weapon is not that strong that the weapon and the bow of the mighty man can broke 